flowers as natural acid base indicator chemicals required sodium hydroxide and oxalic acid apparatus required conical flask two beakers and two petri dishes rajni gandha flower or polyanthus tuberosa as natural acid base indicator at first we pour a little amount of rajni gandha flower extract in the two petri dishes and then we add sodium hydroxide solution in the first petri dish an oxalic acid solution in the second petri dish and observe the change in color the sodium hydroxide solution turns yellow in color and the oxalic acid solution has no effect marigold flower or tagetis erecta as natural acid base indicator this is marigold flower extract we pour a little amount of marigold flower extract into the two petri dishes and then we add sodium hydroxide solution in the first petri dish and oxalic acid solution in the second petri dish and observe the change in color the sodium hydroxide solution turns reddish orange in color while the oxalic acid solution changes its color from yellow to colorless rose flower or rosa as natural acid base indicator This is rose flower extract. We pour a little amount of rose flower extract into the two petri dishes. In this, we have sodium hydroxide solution. We pour sodium hydroxide solution in the first petri dish and oxalic acid solution in the second petri dish and observe the change in color the sodium hydroxide solution turns light orange in color while the oxalic acid solution turns reddish orange in color hibiscus flower or hibiscus rosa sinensis as natural acid base indicator now we have hibiscus flower indicator we pour a little amount of hibiscus flower extract into the two petri dishes we pour sodium hydroxide solution in the first petri dish and we pour the oxalic acid solution in the second petri dish and observe the change in color the oxalic acid solution turns orange in color and the sodium hydroxide solution turns light green in color Gladiolus fiesta flower as natural acid base indicator now we have gladiolus fiesta indicator we pour a little amount of gladiolus fiesta flower extract into the two petri dishes we pour sodium hydroxide solution in the first petri dish and we pour the oxalic acid solution in the second petri dish and observe the change in color the oxalic acid solution turns orange in color and the sodium hydroxide solution turns yellow in color gladiolus yellow flower as natural acid base indicator next we take gladiolus yellow indicator we pour a little amount of gladiolus yellow flower extract in the two petri dishes we pour sodium hydroxide solution in the first petri dish and we pour the oxalic acid solution in the second petri dish and observe the change in color the sodium hydroxide solution turns yellow in color and the oxalic acid solution has no effect sevanthi flower or chrysanthemum as natural acid base indicator Lastly we take sevanthi flower extract indicator 
we pour the seventy flour extract solution into the two petri dishes. We pour sodium hydroxide in the first petri dish and we pour the oxalic acid solution in the second petri dish and observe the change in color. The sodium hydroxide solution turns yellow in color and the oxalic acid solution has no effect. Chemistry behind flowers as natural acid base indicators Colors of the flowers of the plants express their unique character. Natural dyes and pigments in them are highly colored substances and may show color changes with variation of pH value. Several organic compounds which are responsible for the color property of flowers such as flavonoids, anthocyanins, carotenoids, etc. show different colors in different pH and thus this property can be applied to use as a natural indicator. Hope you have enjoyed this demonstration. Thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe.